It was founded by a group of between 20 and 40 neighboring communities of the Arcadian League between the years 371 and 368 before Christ, in an attempt to create a counterweight to the Spartan dominance of the region. Its construction took 10 years and it became the most important city of Arcadia. This is Adventure by Footnotes. I'm Esteban, your guide for today, and together we are going to visit the ruins of ancient Megalopolis. Megalopolis is located in Greece, in the center of the Peloponnese, 195 kilometers from Athens, 60 kilometers from Kalamata, and 2 kilometers away from the center of the current Megalopolis, on both banks of the Alpheus River. South of the river is located the theater, the most impressive ruin of the site. It had a capacity for 20,000 people, and it is considered to be the largest Greek theater of its time. It was 30 meters tall. The first rows of seats are very well preserved. Located next to the theater was the Thersilium, or assembly hall. It was a huge building where Arcadians met to discuss important issues, such as wars, truces, and alliances. It measured 66 by 52 meters, and it contained an auditorium with 65 columns. It could hold up to 8,700 people seated on wooden benches. The columns were arranged so that the center of the building could be seen from any angle. On the other side of the river was the Agora. The largest building in the Agora was the Stoa of Philip, built in order of Philip II of Macedon. It was 155 meters long by 20 meters wide. It had Doric columns on the outside and Ionic columns on the inside. East of the Stoa was an archive building. And west of the Stoa there used to be either a gymnasium or a bulletarium. There was also a temple dedicated to Zeus and a second stoa, which we could not visit. The multiple attacks and invasions made the city slowly fall into disrepair. Strabo visited the place in the year 15 before Christ and described it as a small insignificant city. While in the year 170 AD, it was visited by Pausanias, who found it mostly deserted. Megalopolis can be reached by a bus from Athens. Access to the theater is free of charge, but check the opening hours of the site first. There is free access to the rest of the site, and it can be visited 24 hours a day. To visit both places, you need an hour. If you're considering visiting the area, you will find nearby. Ancient Messine, 46 kilometers to the southwest, probably the best ruins in Greece, and the Menelion of Sparta, 60 kilometers to the southeast, a sanctuary dedicated to Menelaus and his wife, Helen the Beautiful. And that's all for today. See you in the next adventure.